ladies winning the World Cup. We haven't given them a proper cheer yet, have we? <laughs> I think it's something that we won't and they will never forget. But what a team. Please give your huge admiration to two of the stars of the Women's World Cup squad. We've got Kay Wilson and Latoya Mason. <laughs> My first question is something that I've always wanted to know. What's it like to win a World Cup? <laughs> <laughs> oh, it's pretty surreal, really. Yeah, it's it's been a bit crazy these past few weeks, isn't it? Um, but, yeah, it's been fantastic. Still look at this every day. <laughs> so you haven't taken it off for two weeks? Pretty much, yes. Put it by my bed when I go to sleep, wake up, there it is. <laughs> Do you know the best part about it for me, the absolute best part, is now we don't have to keep on going on about 2003 <laughs> and how these guys <laughs> won a World Cup. Now we've got another World Cup winning side. It's amazing, guys, isn't it? <laughs> it was fantastic. I mean, it was really, really... It was great to see you win the final. I was less happy with the semi-final, <laughs> I, I won't lie to you, because Ireland had done so well beating yeah. New Zealand. How much of a confidence booster was it you beating Ireland after they, they'd beaten New Zealand? Yeah, for us, um, that Ireland game was just incredible for us, and, you know, our little basic skills paid off, obviously, by the score and stuff, so it just gave us that massive confidence boost going into the final, and we're just happy with our performance, we just had to kick on. And I like the traditional English rugby player's accent as well. Like <laughs> <laughs> uh, <Kiwi>. Marvellous, <laughs> well done. <laughs> sure you, you, you guys, your feet haven't touched the floor. I mean, I hear there's, there's some sevens contracts been given out. Is that the same yeah. for both of you? Uh, Kay, yeah. you've got the sevens contract and you're back to work. Yeah, we're, right. yep, 12 hour days. <laughs> <laughs> Fantastic. Well, we saw you there, were you? Wouldn't have seen on camera. You were mortified when that <laughs> picture came up of you guys singing. Absolutely mortified. But the team spirit in the squad must have been phenomenal. Oh, it really was, isn't it? I mean, we spend more, probably more time with each other than we do with our own family. So, like, they are kind of like our second family. And, well, um, yeah. Was there anyone, though, who maybe had played with you for four years before the World Cup that didn't quite make the World Cup <laughs> and everyone was really happy wasn't there? <laughs> Actually, like, when we won and you've seen all the past players that have obviously been there and, you know, gone to the World Cups and stuff, and it just felt as though they were a part of that win. Mm -hmm. And just being able to share it with everyone in that crowd, whether it be family, friends or girls who have been come before us, it's just an oh, incredible Brilliant. feeling. I mean, what I'm noticing at the moment is, since you've lifted that, I mean, there's a real, seems to be a real buzz around women's rugby. Do you guys, have you guys seen a change? What would you guys like to see happen? Oh, yeah, I've seen a change. I work for the RFU, so I see that on a daily basis. And not only for women and girls, but, you know, the men and boys who wouldn't really know that we played rugby are saying, you know, congratulations to us and wanting photos with us and stuff. So, so we, we won the under-18 championships, the under-20s, we won the Women's World Cup, so yeah. no pressure, boys. Yeah, no yeah. Pressure. <laughs> one, one thing I would point out, you work for the offering, now would be a really good time to ask for a pay rise. <laughs> <laughs> a really good time. Who won the Grand Slam? I just can't believe uh, what was that? What was that? There, um, it was an interesting World Cup, though, I thought, you know, uh, certainly for the Northern Hemisphere. It felt like quite a landmark mm. World Cup when it, co it comes to women's rugby. Did you see that? Yeah. yeah, especially right throughout, um, you know, even the round robin play, you just, you know, you saw it kind of sticking out a little bit, and then obviously, you know, when what happened happened, it stuck out like a sore thumb, didn't it? <laughs> it's fantastic. Yeah, it really is. Huge congratulations. Fantastic. Thank you so Thank much you. for coming on. <laughs>